Morning, we're starting off our Wednesday halfway through the week with temperatures warming up yet again for your mountains and deserts. Primarily your coastline is going to stay in the low 70s this afternoon and inland. We're looking at another day of 80s. It was just a toasty one out there yesterday, and we're going to continue in that range this afternoon. The excessive heat warning takes effect at 10 a.m. tomorrow and it'll last all the way through Sunday. So Thursday, Friday, Saturday and Sunday, a four day stretch of warmer than normal temperatures and excessive at that you can see the pink is now the upgrade from what was previously an excessive heat watch. It's now a warning and the good ground that it covers across the southwestern US. Along with that, we've got this excessive heat watch in the red all the way up uh, California. And then if you look off toward western Nevada around the Reno area, you've got a heat advisory. We also have a small heat advisory just up to the north of us in the Orange County area. Building ridge of high pressure keeps us warm. It makes that sh uh, marine layer a lot more shallow, and that means that over the next couple days we'll see fewer low clouds, a little bit less fog in the forecast. There is still the chance of that along the immediate coast for this afternoon and really for the morning hours. But by the time we get to the noon hour, we're expecting those clouds to part quite a bit and to move towards sunshine. There's the chance going into Friday, Saturday, maybe even Sunday morning that this ridge of high pressure could help block out the chance of those clouds developing, which means that we could have maybe a chance of viewing that sunrise as opposed to the uh, cloud cover that has inundated the coast for the last several mornings. Here are your forecast highs for this afternoon. Upper 60 and low 70 degree temperatures for the immediate coast. Sea breeze and coastal eddy continuing to push clouds along shore. Uh, as you move farther inland, widespread 80s, 83 for Escondido, 84 for Ramona, 77 in Miramar, and 88 in Julian for that forecast high. 110 for Borrego Springs. So the hottest days, temperatures peak Friday and Saturday alongside plenty of sunshine. Looks like we'll start a gradual cool down from Sunday and beyond, but stay above average for the most part in the 80s for your uh, inland valleys, even stretching to 90 degrees by Saturday. Mountains are going to be in the upper 80s, and we have deserts climbing to 116 by Friday and Saturday, too, cooling down to 106 by the middle of next week.